Welcome back. The impact on people living with dementia and their families can be heartbreaking. But a new TV awareness campaign aims to help ease that pain. Its message is honest and real. Yeah. Behaviours in dementia are very, very complex. Mary, sweetheart. It's me, honey. Tears flowed as they farewelled 95-year-old dementia sufferer Claire Nowland this week. The great-grandmother died after being tasered by a police officer at her Kerma nursing home. My heart goes out to the family of Mrs Nowland and to all the staff, everybody involved in that incident. Police were called to Yalambi Lodge last month after Mrs Nowland got hold of a knife. I think it shows what can happen when people with dementia have those change behaviours and are in a situation where they're obviously scared or worried. Professor Sue Curl is a geriatrician. About 95% of people with dementia will have some sort of unusual behaviour. Aggression and agitation are very common. She's seen firsthand the impact of dementia on sufferers and their families and carers. My mother had dementia. She was in care for six years and we watched her behaviours change over that period of time. Professor Curl knew what to expect and who to ask for help. It's really important to look at the person and think, why are they behaving like this? What's behind it? What's underneath? You know I turned it on. In 2022, there were over 400,000 people living with dementia. Marie Alford heads up Dementia Support Australia, which is releasing a new national television awareness campaign. You OK? We really need carers to be able to see themselves in the experience of living with and caring for someone with dementia. We want them to reach out for help. We want them to reach out before they reach their limits. It is confronting, but it's real life. If you live to 85, and most people want to live to 85, one in three of us will have dementia. I think it's important to understand that dementia is more than just memory loss, and I think that that can get lost sometimes. So can you just tell me a little bit about... What the Alexandra Smith is on the front line. The if you're supporting a person living with dementia and you notice a change in their behaviour, it's incredibly important to call us early. Don't want it. The Dementia Support Australia consultant says the TV campaign is real. It certainly can be confronting, but I think that it helps um, that we're able to destigmatize. Professor Curl hopes the hard-hitting campaign will bring better understanding. I knew who to ask for help. I want to make sure everyone else out there can ask for help in the same way. It's about my mom. I think we need help. And if you need support, you can reach out to Dementia Support Australia, the number 1800 699 799.